because there is no other alternative right now. There's not even, when the Taliban were in power last time, there was a Northern Alliance where there was a, a conflict going on. There's no conflict now in Afghanistan, which is, by the way, after 40 years, this is the first time the country is conflict-free, apart from, you know, a small uh, uh, terrorist organizations, which are, which the more stability in Afghanistan, the less chance of any of these international terrorists to survive there. So I feel that the only way forward is recognition. Pakistan can't do it alone. I think we, we are consulting all the regional countries. But, uh, you know, for the well-being of the people of Afghanistan, sooner or later they will have to recognize Afghanistan. Now the question is, what are the conditions? Now, as far as we, uh, I, I can see from, uh, there's an international consensus that there should be one inclusive government. And number two, um, human rights, specifically female rights, women rights. So um, the Taliban government pledged both. They've talked about human rights and they've talked about inclusive government. Now the question is, what will it take for the world to be satisfied that they, the Taliban meet the condition? Right. This is really the condition because they've agreed to the, the, the two conditions.